I'm a retired Army Master Sergeant, multiple combat deployments, Bronze Star, Purple Heart, Valor Award recipient. You know, in the IED ambush I was hit with, I lost myself along with my guys. And I had that guilt that maybe I could have done something differently. And I beat myself up with that. And on top of the meds that were prescribed, which didn't do enough for the nightmares, the flashbacks, the intrusive thoughts. I, I went to what I knew and uh, what I've seen in my life, and that's the bottle and anything and everything that felt good to get me out of my head, numb the pain, and help me to sleep. From there, you know, things got bad. I ended up incarcerated for a little while, and uh, I started the sober journey there. After three months in treatment, I had nowhere to turn and I found Liberty House. It's a brotherhood that a lot of people don't understand. You come to a place like Liberty House with all veterans, you get the feeling somebody has your back and we're kind of doing it all together. Um, and there's nothing better than a total sober community to do that. Hey, it's home. Yeah. Gotta awesome. make it look good. Another handshake, great job. The staff here is phenomenal. You can talk to them about anything. They, they get it, they understand it. I've been set up with New Hampshire Tech for Licensed Alcohol and Drug Counselor Program, and I will be going full-time by January, and I already have job offers for when I graduate from school. Working within the veteran community, helping those like myself that had nowhere else to turn. To all those that have donated to Liberty House, if it weren't for people like you, um, the veterans like myself would be on the streets. The second chance that's offered to me and to the other veterans that, that pretty much thought hope was gone, and uh, the support is just incredible. This is my second chance.